good morning guys good morning i'm out here we are in my boat it is a lovely mid-january day i mean it's fabulous out here today it's a big blue but we've had a big front that came through a few days ago and we're on the back end of a full moon about four days three four days afterwards so we are pushing our luck we will be we're still gonna try we're gonna see if we can catch a fish today float rig fishing gonna try to catch us some speckled trout let's go paul let's go chris paul has one I am the captain now. Well, he's just gave up. He's tired. He's like, yeah, You got me. <laughs> oh, he's got a tired trout. Yeah, you know, show him to the camera, Paul. Come on, man. There's cameras everywhere on this boat. You're just saying that because I said that to you. you I am. Time. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Getting the call back. This is Chris Nichols for a bench tour. I see you. Oh, I see you. I'm about to see one of my own here. I'm about ready to stab you with the trout. The trout I'm going to stab you right in the side. It's the nut. The nut! Eric? All right. It feels a little sharky. Does it feel sharky? I mean, it's hard to... He's staying down, that's for sure. That could be a... That could be a nice trout. Could be a shark though. Lincoln sharks. It's a good size one. Man, oh, sorry. What's wrong with us? Ooh, what's a what, what? What are those called? I don't know what these are. All right. It's a big one. Big guy. It's our start. No, it isn't. It's your start. It's my start. How do you get that? Paul's on. We're on a little hot streak here. Hot streak! Hot! hot. Up in here. Maybe another uh, trout. Let's see if he's going in the... Going in the well. Are you going to go in the well? No. No. <laughs> that ain't going in my live well. Going in my... Oh! Chris got, Chris got a fish! This feels trout-like. That's a big one. Maybe he'll be pretty decent. He's fighting. like a big one. Come on. Big man. Oh, no. It's not big at all. <laughs> he's, okay. he's bigger than I just got. Uh, oh, you know what? I forgot to show your folks. Mine was like this, but a little smaller. Just in case I didn't, I didn't show you the one I caught. You're about to make mean Chris come out. But it's just a little... Did you get me a shirt? I got this great big one. Anyway, I was watching the Dallas Cowboy game, or I don't know what game it was. Oh, fish on again. I guess I might as well stop talking. Tell me to shut up and fish. These guys are very uh, lively today, aren't they? Yes. I guess because cool. that water is pulled off. The water. Yeah. They're, they're feeling like they need to eat. They're like, you know what? We better eat. We haven't eaten for a couple days. It's going to get cold. Cool. We need to cool. draw some fat. Oh, we're good. Chris has another fish. He is out fishing me again. That's okay. Chris is the best fisher. No. Yeah, you are. Not. Look at that. That is a speckled trout. This looks pretty. pretty. They are gorgeous. Pretty. You're in the modeling school. These trout belong to a modeling school. here bring him on in come on here yeah he's got bait right in his mouth yeah you tell he's trying he's the one that's trying to eat these shrimp you see how he tried to get my shrimp see my teeth ah <laughs> you're gonna laugh when you go back and see that I'm not laughing. yeah you will
first night you did have that shallow. See, I was fishing through there with a big. Paul's been catching the fish up here in the shallow water. When I say been catching, I mean the two fish that we've caught right here. And he's had some bites, but they've all been up here in the shallow water. And I've been fishing back here trying to see if there's fish in the deeper water. So Paul says, I usually catch them right there, you know, like to the left right here. Throws his thing out there, catches a fish first time. I'm gonna tell him. you what, that what? is some, some crazy stuff. That's crazy I stuff. I told you I usually catch them right there. You don't, nobody tells me on my boat, if you do it again, I'm throwing right there. I'm gonna do exactly what you say. I'm gonna leave There's the camera. There's a hump. On. See where my bobber is there? Yeah, that's where that big shell yeah, thing uh -huh. is. Stay right where I'm at. You kidding me? Nope. Did you have a bite? Okay, here we go. Y'all probably aren't as excited as we are, but let's take my word for it. I'm out here, you sit for five hours, and I get a bite. Yeah, that's why it's so exciting. It's not because it's just something exciting. It's because you sit here, and sit here, and sit here, and then all of a sudden, you a boom, you get a bite. Ooh. See, you guys get to sit at home and just go straight to the bites. How lucky are you? Maybe I should just watch fishing videos. Yeah. Oh, there he is. What is happening on this planet right now? <laughs> What in the world is going on? I was three foot from that fish. Three foot. Oh. Paul caught him and I did. Right. And actually, mine's about the same way this year. Yeah, this is, that's a fine looking. Could you see the expression on that fish's face? I know, he's, he's amazed. He's just looking at you. He is totally. Because why didn't you catch me? He's enamored with me. Mm. I love this guy. Ah. Love this guy. You know what it was? Right there, Paul. What was it? You, so you explain to me what it was. Because I'm all, you, you started, I'm ready to learn new things. You started the day off all mean. That's true. And you can't do that. Mean Chris. You're all mean Chris today. There you go. Oh! Start being a little happy, like I am. Happy Paul, mean Chris. Shut up. But I am willing to learn. <laughs> I mean, don't shut up completely. I mean, keep I'm telling me what you're doing. Tell me the things I need to know and shut up. Just be happy about it. Man, I'm in the littlest troutest spot. Of course, I'm casting them, so I shouldn't complain. I don't even know what he's doing. I can't even explain why he's catching fish. And I'm not. Oh, it's probably because I'm not. Yeah. Even holding my pole in my hands. I'm gonna have to switch over to my other pole. This one ain't getting it for some reason. Apparently that's the uh nice fish. Better than what we've been catching. A whole lot. Not a whole. But it is better. Let's be honest. Chris has big hands. That's why I look so small. Chris is time! When I said this is the way I'm going to catch them. No, I'm laughing at it because you're sardine. Because of that. <laughs> so I just laughing. Yeah, it is kind of laughable. This is the smallest trout today. But you know what? I'm so you're happy. I'm proud. I'm proud that I caught that trout. Yeah. I'm not going to apologize for catching a trout. Paul or any of, anybody else. There you go. Here we go. He's better. Is he? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good looking fish. That's a that can keep the uh sheep. Now Paul was catching fish. He had a little bit lighter weight and float than I did. Not a lot, but just a little. So I switched over 
to my lighter weight i copied paul switched over to my half ounce weight and half ounce bobber and i'm catching fish paul knows paul knows Very strange that that, <laughs> that just that little bit of difference in it the is. weight, it's just that little weight of the float in the ball. That's what I, I was telling on my last video, Paul. Yeah. Uh -huh. Is that you know people will just have one float and one yeah. you know float rig and that's all they fish. They yeah. don't ever change the weight. They don't ever change the you know how light or how heavy it is. that I always carry two. I have a light one and a heavier one. Cause, That's smart fishing. Because I have had enough times where you were catching them and I wasn't catching them. And you had a lighter weight and a lighter float. And then there's times where I'll catch them and you won't. Because I have a heavier, heavier you know, weight. Yeah. I swear, Paul, you are just the weirdest little girl. <laughs> <laughs> little redhead girl. Just the weirdest little girl. So weird. Oh, 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 I hope we got that on camera. Like we're bringing in a dead, dead boat. Come on. Hey, and they separated. Folks, Water is big and wide, right? Yes. I yes. threw my, and I fished Chris's bobber. There's this whole ocean. Yeah. Everything from here all the way over to like Europe and Africa. Yeah. Now Chris was out there a good, what would you say, 40 yards? Yeah. 40 feet Maybe. anyway, 40 feet. 40 feet, 40, feet, 40 yards. Argue, yeah. And I yeah. threw. It's a little different. Right on top of his bobber. He hit my bobber. I felt it. You got to fish. No, you don't. No. I felt it hit my bobber. Have you seen it? I saw it. One scratching his back. Chris, get up there so I can play with him. <laughs> cool. Look at oh, those right more. there. Uh oh. Doggy, he was after some fish there. Man, there's a lot of them out there. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. All the way up through there. That whole bank is crickets. Dolphins everywhere. Yeah, they're all moving down that way. Anybody has an answer to that? Let Paul know. <laughs> he doesn't know why he does the things he does. Go to Horsley <laughs> Retirement <laughs> Adventures and explain and to explain him. Explain to me why he acts the way he acts. All right, what's the deal with this bike? There you go. Here you Paul. Paul's got one. I think I got one that time. Paul got one this time. We can be playing around, guys. This ain't no joke. <laughs> real fish. Real. There you go, Paul. Keep it on the yeah. Almost, though. Man, it's close. You're close, buddy. They want to measure you. No, you're, there's no reason they to measure you. Well, how old are you? Just talk to Well, guys, we are calling it a day. Not the greatest fishing day ever, but not the worst. Kind of a middling kind of fishing day. I don't know. Middle. I mean, okay. It's okay. It was, it was worth it was worth going. Better well, than a sharp stick in the eye. Uh, something like that, you know. I've had a sharp stick in the eye. It's what I mean. much better. Now. I mean, obviously, yeah. It's much better. So now. thanks for watching. And I hope you enjoy this more than a sharp stick in the eye. Yeah!